Man, I'm posted up, man, trying to have a good time. I'm out here, you know what I mean? With well, Starlito out this way in my city, so it's only right, you know what I mean? Plus, I had a night of lights artist performing tonight, you know what I mean? Shout out Leamber, Debo, Young Tone, we just got it in, you know what I mean, on stage. So it's real silly. Shout out Southside, they ain't here heavy. So you've you been in the game, definitely been representing, holding it down, really, for Naptown, uh, setting the foundation, you know what I'm saying, for the hip-hop community or whatever. So what's going on these days with DJ Ready Rock? It's getting real serious out here, man. This is worldwide, you know what I mean? Dealing with violators is like the next step, you know what I mean? I'm kind of gone on the road a lot, still intermingling. Got some things popping off. Big shout out to Freddie Gibbs. I'm probably about to go be in this video next week. You know what I mean? Got a new single popping. Me and Freddie Gibbs got a nice mixtape coming. DJ Rock, something silly. Um, I mean, it's, it's, it's real silly. Lil Nut home, you know what I mean? I got a nice mixtape with Lil Nut coming. Shout out Swole, we got something silly again. We back in there, so, I mean, this 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 next quarter right now is kind of like the fourth quarter. A couple of the starters is coming off the bench. I got HMBT coming back again for, you know what I mean, part two. So, it's, it's real silly right now. You know, ReadyRock.com is really jumping off right now. Yeah, check that out. I definitely check that out. That is high and popping, you know what I'm saying? It is. It's you know I'm, I was trying to make a site that was a no nonsense where you can just come in, yeah. click, get some mixtapes, and let the product speak for the less of it. You know what I mean? It's right. not really a lot of glitz and glamour. I mean it's rough, it's rugged. It's right. showing you the product, it's showing you what I offer, and you know what I mean. Hopefully you can come and get something. You know what I mean? Rock it so so I know you you are doing the mixtapes for artists. Like are you doing like some artist development right now, or like what what other things are you doing like as far as artists are concerned? I am, I am. I'm dealing with a few artists, you know what I mean, nationally wise and locally, you know okay. what I mean? And I just try to provide, I call it getting in the game or, you know what I mean, putting people in the game, but it's really, uh, I'm just, you know what I mean, schooling them on, not necessarily schooling them, but just sharing some part of my advice or the stairs and the, and the way that I went through the industry and some things that I know and some ways that they can kind of cut corners and maybe, you know, deal with some other people over here that's working and, you know what I mean? change kind of your goals to, to more obtainable goals, you know what I mean, so it can make sense to you, you know what I mean? At the end of the day, you got to make money so that it can make sense, so that you can t continue to strive to get somewhere, you know what I mean? So this is kind of the things that I do, you know what I mean, my phone ringing constantly. You know I know. I mean? <laughs> Uh, well, actually, DJ Rick Juan posed a question earlier today on Facebook, and he was saying that he gets a lot of artists that hit him up, like, wanting to get their record broken. And at the same time, in return, him as a DJ, like, what does an artist, uh, how does a, a DJ benefit from that? I say it's kind of hard for a DJ to break a record if the record isn't already broken in the area. Okay. See, it starts from the groundwork, you know what I mean? I take it, I take it a record like a current one that I'm using right now, for example. It's D-Rock, and it's a song called Meat Rose. It's one of my heavy songs in rotation. Okay. Everybody loves the song. I had nothing personally to do with this song. Right. You know what I mean? I so is it, is it that people start coming up to you, like, can you play it, or? Exactly. The heat. He had put enough of his mixtapes out in the street to where it was a demand for this song. People are already reacting to it. I got asked a few genuine times to play this song by some people who was really like, hey, you know, get the CD, like, it's something nice. You know what I mean? And, and finally, when I did interact with him and get to him and get the music, his attitude was right. 
he was still working, making a big situation out of the record, you know what I mean? And now it's a response to where it's one of the hottest requested songs now. Like, I didn't do that. So you can't say I broke the record, I provided a service. I do what I'm supposed to do, I play the hits. I play the hits. If you make a little effort on making your song the hits, and even your little select region, your neighborhood, and even more than that, then I know that when I come to the club, and at 2 o'clock, when my boss or somebody in the club owner is watching me, it makes sense for me to play this record, because at least 40 people from your hood is going to get hyped, or go buy some drinks, or do something, you know what I mean? It, it makes sense, in hand in hand. All I'm saying is, don't, put, don't screw up my money, I won't screw up yours. So, so how, how does the artist get a mixtape from you? Reach me, holler at me, readyrock.com. It's a link on there, you can email me. I'll let you in on my email. Ready, R-E-D-D-Y, 625 at gmail.com. Holler at me. Be serious, though, because I'm serious. I'm about business. I'll get you on through there if you're talking about the right thing. You also be on Twitter with your Wake and Bake Thoughts. What's your, hey. what's your Twitter? <laughs> Check this out, though. I see a lot of people out there coming up with little tags for that little shit that they say. And everybody know I've been waking back thoughts for a few years now. Yes, you have. So let's just put that out there. So yeah, follow me on Twitter at Coach Red. I have some interesting things to say in the morning. Wake and bake thoughts. Now lately I've been in the lab late nights, you know what I mean? So I've been doing my, my I'm back in the studio real heavy late nights, so I've been getting up midday. So the new thing is coming up is midday bake. So when you, you know what I mean? When you run into the midday bake, that'll be something a little after one, two o'clock. You mean it might not be my first bake, but it'll be my midday bake. And I have a call in midday here, you know what I mean? Well, we'll be keeping up with you then, definitely. You know, anystarnetwork.com, DJ Ready Rock. Y'all make sure y'all keep up with him.